Shop with me at Dollar Tree. I'm at a new location today. Let's see what they have. Look at these really cool iridescent organizers. They're meant for the desk, but you could honestly use this anywhere in your house, your fridge, your vanity, desk, whatever you want. These are so cute. They have a few different types. They had so many different new hair items at this location. These butterfly clips, how cute. They're iridescent. I saw a pink and a blue. They also had these jumbo jaw clips. And I like that they're flat to the head. And I saw a pink and a purple in those ones. These are the headbands that the girlies use when they do their makeup to just put their hair back. These like velvet, huge cloud poofy headbands. I found some Care Bear socks. Those are really cute. And then I also saw the Peanuts socks. I'm still looking for the Paul Frank socks. This is a new item by like the Scrub Buddies, I think it's called. And this is a soap dispenser brush. For $1.25, this is awesome. I spent like $2 and something at Walmart on one of these. And then I also found the Viral Body Wash that's supposed to be a dupe for the Native brand, I think. I saw the peach ring, the jelly bean, and then you'll see in a second, I also saw the coconut. Also spotted these um, body washes that are supposed to be comparable to Olay. And I saw this, I don't know what this is. I haven't seen anybody uh, find this yet, but reviving aloe mist. Uh, I guess it's for your face. I'm not really sure. And they also had the Olay dupes for the lotions. I have the vitamin C. It's all right, but I just bought the hyaluronic acid. I really want to try that out. Then they had the oils stocked up if you need coconut body oil, or vitamin E. I haven't seen this one yet. It's a sea salt hair spritz, um, probably to give some texture. And I finally found the three-in-one leave-in hair conditioner. I'm definitely picking this up. It's supposed to be like the Sun Bum leave-in conditioner. So I heard it was really good. I'll let you guys know. Found some witch hazel like toner or witch hazel solution. And I'm actually gonna be using this for a homemade like bug spray and then i saw some dove beauty cream for the face and body now i always see these but they're not usually for face and body the pond's perfect color complex moisturizer is pretty good this was new i've never seen this before exfoliating scrub with vitamin c and niacinamide and then these blemish patches everybody's talking about and this is new you guys this is supposed to be like the neutrogena spot treatment Wow, this is pretty cool. Benzoyl peroxide, acne medication, love it. And then I found the tanning oil, which I also heard really good things about, so I'm definitely picking this one up. They had a bunch of after sun products. They have soothing after sun towelettes. They've got the gel. And I found the viral travel brush kit by Sash Sassy and Chic. They had a purple, pink, and a green. I thought this was so cute and I love how big the mirror is, but I didn't pick it up because I honestly probably won't use these brushes, but I think it's really cute. Let's see what's new in the makeup. I wanted to point out these jelly bronzers, you guys. I bought this, I think, a year ago. They're by Rimmel. This is brand name makeup, and the jelly bronzer is actually really good, and I use it all the time. And you guys, I finally found this. I've been looking for this everywhere. I'm so excited. This is the Be Pure Clean Beauty like jelly um, lip jelly or whatnot. This is the shade Sandy. I'm super excited to try this. I can't believe I finally found it. I've been looking for it forever. And the ingredients look good. So I also saw this Berry Nail Hydration Set. Has anybody tried this? It looks good, it looks cute, let me know. These are some cute little nails. It's giving Y2K-ish. And then I found this perfect mini brow kit by Ioni, and I've never seen this before. Let me know if you've tried it. It comes with a wax, a brow highlight, and two different brow um, powders. And I did hear that this um, cream gel blush is a dupe for Charlotte Tilbury, was it? Or something high-end dupe. I heard they were really good. They've also got some eyeshadow quads and then some like lip oil or lip glosses here. 
Saw some Bolero skincare. This is an under eye elixir with green tea and cucumber and vitamin C. On the Yuka app, it was rated good. And so was this under eye cream with hyaluronic acid and vitamin E. Found this moisturizing lip mask by Be Pure, but it only comes with one for $1.25. So I would hold out for the um, eight pack or six pack that um, Dollar Tree usually has. I also saw this brightening under eye mask, but it only comes with one. And you guys, these face masks, these sheet masks are really good. They're rated excellent on the Yuka app and I love them. Something new in like the cleaning products area. This looks like it's supposed to be like Febreze. It's an air freshener, smoke and odor eliminator. It's good for pets smells um i don't smoke in my house or anything but i picked it up for just funky smells and honestly i'm thinking about my kids sports stuff or shoes and you guys i finally found the viral like venti studded starbucks cup dupe i'm so excited it was literally randomly on a shelf and then i found one more at the register that somebody put back i cannot believe it today is my lucky day thanks for shopping with me follow for more